Because... Hey, this is official business. We've got an emergency. You? Officials? You must be joking. Oh, yeah? Why is that? Well, first, the Federation's armbands are orange, not yellow. And second, it looks like you got a baby to draw the uh. logo. And finally, I can't imagine why the Federation would call on three kids for emergency situations. That's easy. It's a ninja operation. They want discretion and stealth. We move in and slap. Then we clear out. <laughs> Okay, you win. We're not Federation. You can come with us. <laughs> I don't think so. I'm no liar. All right, little Miss Know-It-All. Line up like a good girl. What's the big problem? Just let us through already. Mm -mm. Huh? Let's move out. Wait, I... <sighs> I can't believe we're going to miss everything because of Miss Know-It-All. No worries. I know a place where we can get a great view, Cosmo. <laughs> Bishop? Bishop! What's he doing with Marcellus King? Together at the Marble Games? Here we are again for the great Marble Gen confrontation, the incredible magic power of marbles created by alchemy. And talking of alchemy, you yourself decide marbles for the Ryo family, I believe. The past is the past. It's the present that counts. Obviously, you still have a deep passion for Marble Gems. That's why you're here today, right? My passion for Marble Gems has never faltered, young lady. And it is why I financed the renovation of this incredible arena. Marble Gen tournaments deserve such a glorious showcase. The time has come. stones. In the beginning of time, the Emerald Table enclosed within it all the forces of nature. These powers were coveted by many. To put an end to their destructive envy, five marbles were created. They were powerful enough to contain the forces of nature, air, earth, fire, water, and lightning. The five energy marbles were entrusted to the five alchemists on the condition that they never bring them together. The Tahira family were entrusted Venus and the power of water. The 
Levy family took Saturn and the power of Earth. The Ryu family inherited Jupiter and the power of lightning. The Shenlong family given Mars and the power of fire. And the Costello family of Olympia had the privilege of protecting Mercury and the power of wind. Several years ago, the Costello family lost Mercury in a catastrophic battle. And our precious treasure was taken from our beautiful city. But today, ladies and gentlemen, Mercury has returned to Olympia. The incredible prize for the 100th winner of the competition is Mercury! Mercury! One of the most powerful marbles in the world! It must have the power of one million marble gems! three marble gems and plays them three times in turn. The team that shoots the most marbles into the pit before time runs out wins the game! Get those marbles rolling! It won't take much to push that marble over the edge. The Tuaregs are going to have to be careful!
grabbed a marble gem had breached the pit. I know. The Tuaregs are better snipers by far. But the Olympians, they've got wicked marble gems. And no surprise. Gaia's their alchemist. She's the best in Olympia. Hey! If it isn't Miss Know-It-All playing over there. No! First she kicks us out of the arena, and now she's squatting in our square! <laughs> I'm glad I'm not in her place. Who are you to come playing in my square? Hmm. Uh, I didn't know that. Tell you what, give me your marbles and maybe I'll just let you go. Uh? Leave her alone, Bishop. What's the matter, Cosmo? Want to take her place? Why not? Ah. <sighs> Why don't the two of us sort this out instead? <laughs> A battle, huh? Why don't we use classic marbles with marble gen rules? Whoever wins gets the new girl's marbles. You're going to regret this. Hang on, guys. Hmm? These are my marbles, so if anyone's gonna play, it's me. Uh, can't you see I'm defending you here? I don't need anyone to defend me. They're my marbles, my battle. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> you two are so adorable. Marble games are played in pairs. So how about a duo battle? Your team against Bishop and I. All right. Woohoo! All right, Let's win! Go, Cosmo! You can win uh, this! Huh? Uh... You okay? You're not chickening out, are you? Who, me? No way! <laughs> All right, my little marble fanatics! Ready for a wild and wacky battle? Bishop and Callie against Cosmo and the new girl going head to head! You have three marbles per sniper! Get ready to roll! What are you doing? It's our turn to play now! In this type of game zone, you have to take advantage of centrifugal force, so heavy marbles are best. Centrifugal what? Huh, is that flim flams for losers? You wanna see a real sniper? Watch and learn! This is the part where I say, The Cosmic Pose! Central funky force when you really know how to snipe. <laughs> nice throw, kid. Huh? But now it's over. Time to kiss your marble. <laughs> hmm. oh. You're finished. Your marble's not gonna stay there for long. Hold on. There's mm -hmm. something weird about that silver marble. You're just saying that because you couldn't take it out. No, I'm only saying that because what matters in battle is scoring points, not playing the clown. Yeah, 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 that doesn't matter in a battle. Tell me, how do you intend to score? By taking advantage of the game terrain's idiosyncrasies. <laughs> Naturally, the game terrain's idiosyncrasies. <laughs> If I use the 25% hmm. slope and its dynamic, I can give my marble enough power to reach the pit in one shot. You're wrong because... Oh. It's the mathematics. Logically, it should have... In case you didn't know, Princess, there's a big difference between power and pavement. Hmm. <laughs> it's 1-0. Beat that, if you can. Uh, I'll show you what I think about your royal spin. Wait, it's a trap! <sighs> are made of a whole range of materials. Clay, glass, stone. I believe that Kelly is using metal marbles. Metal marbles are often heavier than others. 
It's a disaster! The real disaster is this. If those two don't snap out of it and start playing together, they're going to lose big time. There is something dodgy about her marbles. If you listen to if me. If you're that good, why don't you win them back yourself? Look, I didn't ask you to help me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, time out, time out! Luna? Hey. What are you doing here, Luna? Get out of the game zone. During the game, each team gets two timeouts. That said, timeout! <laughs> Okay, what's the problem? This is all her fault. She started nothing. She tried to warn you about Callie's little game, but you didn't listen. And you, little Miss Know-It-All, you should be exploiting Cosmo's talents rather than trying to prove that you're better than him. He may be stubborn, but he's the best sniper in the hood. Mm, okay, yeah, the Cosmic Puck was pretty impressive. Okay, fine, you've got a better feel for the game. If you play as a team, you can wipe the floor with these guys. Hi there, my name's Luna. <laughs> <laughs> and he's Cosmo, but you've met him already. <laughs> and I'm Sam. Aisa, nice to meet you. Go on, kiss and make up! Okay, how are we supposed to win this? They've got metal marbles and they're totally blocking us out. I think I have a solution. Kali's metal marbles are hard to take out, but there's a weak point that we have to take note of. A magnetite marble! Great idea! If you could get the marble to land just there. <laughs> you want it? You got it! Marbles are powerful players, but they have one important weak point, magnetic waves. That's why Aisa chose a marble made of magnetite, which is used to make marbles. So when Cosmo placed his marble in the middle of Kali's, its magnetic forces were liberated to create a super magnetic pull that attracts metal marbles. Wow, Aisa sure is one smart player! That's right! Together with Cosmo, they form a perfect team! Perfect enough to play in the marble game? Yeah! Perfect enough to win Mercury! <laughs> Hey, that's cheating! Marble's immobilized and disqualified! Yeah! All right! So, do you want to finish this now or go home and cry first? Sidewalk battles. Kelly here is Marcellus King's daughter, and together we're playing in the next Marble Games. Mr. King has formed his own team, the Monarchs, and he has every intention of winning this tournament. But King's just a failed alchemist. He doesn't know a thing about Marble Gems. <laughs> Who needs Marble Gems when we have Marble Tanks? Marble Tanks? That's pathetic. These babies function using technology. The magic is replaced by electricity. Thunder Dragon! <laughs> With these marbles, we'll definitely win. Bishop? What? That's enough. All right, see you losers. <laughs> <laughs> So that's why Bishop was with King at the battle. That means if Bishop wins the marble games, King wins Mercury. And who knows what he might do with the infinite power of an origin marble. <sighs> we can't let King get his hands on that power. We have to take part in the tournament. We have to win Mercury. But the marble games are reserved for elite snipers. Let's not forget that if we want to take part, we need marble gens and an alchemist. You easily have what it takes. But as for the other stuff... What? 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 
I promised I wouldn't say anything. But I'll show you if you come with me. Okay, let's go. Sorry, but I can't join you. I missed my piano lesson. My folks are so mad at me. That means you're already in trouble. You got nothing to lose anymore. Please come, Aisa. If we're going to win the marble games, we need a super sniper like you. Okay, but it better be quick. I really have to get home. <laughs> What's up, Mr. Z? Dad, meet Ayisa. She's a new friend. Uh, hello there. Good day. Hmm? We'll just grab a bite. Oh. Luna, what are we waiting for? Didn't you want to show us something? Shh. I'm waiting for the signal. Signal? What signal? That signal. <sighs> To do. She's not here. What do we do? What I'm about to show you is a secret. You must promise me to never say anything about this to anyone, okay? I promise. Got it. All right. Wow. What is that? Alchemist's workshop! Whoa. Oh. <laughs> Hold on, are these marble gems? What are you doing in 